Today is the day that you have chosen to honor your commitment to one another. Out of the routine of ordinary life, something extraordinary is about to happen. Marriage will be the most challenging, rewarding, and fulfilling commitment you will ever make. It is built upon trust, loyalty, vulnerability, sacrifice, joy, and tears. Every father knows that one day his daughter is going to fly the nest and most likely get married. He hopes that she finds the right person, one that makes her happy, and when the time comes, all he can do is hope for the best. Today is that day, the one I've thought about since the day she was born. I asked Greg and Aaron what qualities they most appreciated, admired, and loved about each other. Greg responded with Aaron's beauty, her work ethic, her sense of humor, her smile, and cre creativity, and how family oriented she is. Aaron has always been strong, hard working, smart, kind, and wise beyond her years. And on top of all of that, you're kind, and you're funny, and you're easygoing. And whether you're dancing until 2 a.m. when you have to work at 6 a.m., eating an In-N-Out burger and four bites publicly while we cheered you on because we dared you to. <laughs> Which, spoiler alert, she finished. <laughs> it was a great moment. You're truly an impressive woman, and I can't wait to see the life you build with Greg. You're going to be an incredible partner, wife, and mother. Every time I saw them together, I knew he was completely enamored by her. He didn't have to say it or explain it. You could just see it in him. And I think for all of us on Aaron's side, you can't ask for more than seeing a man's genuine adoration and love for her. I'll never forget when I started to see something new in her life. I would see pictures of her out on a boat or on vacation with this new young man. She seemed so happy. I met Greg shortly after and was struck by his kindness, love, and honesty. I found, to be, I found Greg to be very honorable, respectful, and sensitive to others, and I knew at that time he would be a great fit for our family and a wonderful partner for Aaron. For anyone who knows Greg, you know that he was completely charming, full of one-liners, and kept us laughing the entire time. At the end of the day, Erin drove me to Bart, and of course she asked me, so what do you think, is he into me? And at first I kind of laughed this off, like, is she serious? And with this reaction, she seemed confused, and prompted me for more information, at which time I explained that he was so obviously head over heels for her. When I first met Greg, he seemed like a nice young man. But once I got to know him, I realized he's a great young man and he comes from a great family. I couldn't have chosen a more suitable person for Aaron. At dinner, I looked at Aaron and I said, this is it, you're getting married, this is crazy. And I remember because we were in this busy restaurant and she just looked at me so directly and she said, Lex, I feel so incredibly loved every day. I have no idea what I did to deserve him or this life, but I feel so lucky. Aaron, our family and friends describe us as making a great team. I agree. Beyond making a great team, we've fallen in love. We're finally here, and somehow it's our wedding day. Since our first trip to Target, it's been quite an awesome journey. And I think every day how lucky I am that we found each other. I promise you that I will always be there for you and our family no matter what happens. I promise to make you laugh every day, even if it's at my own expense, sometimes yours. <laughs> You're my best friend and sometimes my greatest challenge, but most importantly, you make me happier than I could have ever imagined and more loved than I ever thought possible. I promise to love you unconditionally forever, just like what happens in all the overly predictable rom-coms we somehow always watch. I promise to remember that neither one of us is perfect, but we are perfect for each other. I promise to fight for you in our relationship. On our hardest days, 
I'm gonna remember how I feel right here in this moment. So in love with you. Aaron, I love you. Let's enjoy and remember the best day of our lives, surrounded by all of our beautiful family and friends. And above all, I promise to grow with you through all the phases of our life. I love you so much, and I'm so proud to be your wife today. With this ring, I thee wed. With this ring, I thee wed. By the power invested in me by the state of California and the Universal Life Church, I now pronounce you husband and wife. I know you've been waiting for this, Greg. Greg, you may kiss your bride. First to Greg, <laughs> from all of us on Aaron's side, thank you for finding her. And second, cheers to the newlyweds. May you share a lifetime of even on your hardest days, remembering how lucky you are. May the meaning of this hour be fulfilled through the days and years to come. May the love the, of this man and this woman, their unity of spirit, grow deeper and stronger in the uncertainties and changes of life they will share. Loving each other, May they love all persons. Trusting each other, may they learn to trust life. Enjoy every moment of what you've found. Walk to your own drum, but now to hers too. Harmonize, whistle, it's fresh and new. So listen up, kid, you still got her hand? All right, life's too quick, so slip on that band. Stay on target now. Let's all take a sip to love and family. Let's enjoy it to the last drip. Thank you. Thank you to my daughter and her husband, my son-in-law. Wow. They're making me the happiest, proudest dad I can imagine. I can't wait to see what the future unfolds. And again, to all of you for joining us in this celebration and for helping make this a magnificent occasion.